What's up, worlds? The Seven Worlds Gaming here today, and today I'm bringing you an Asphalt Street Storm video, and it's gonna go ahead and show you how to launch in the game because I know it can be very challenging. If at any moment you enjoy this video, if it helps you out, make sure to like and share it to some of your friends that are also playing the game. So, with that said, let's go ahead and go right into this and figure out how you can improve your launch. Now, what I do want to tell you is when you practice, because you are gonna have to practice a lot, every car barriers you are going to be running into something like this which is something i run into a lot just a full start don't worry about it okay <laughs> it happens to the best of us now when i started playing my reaction time was almost at one second 0.9 seconds 0.6 and i've been able to get it down to 0 0.02 point, 0 0.03 and 0 0.01 so i'm gonna go ahead and show you just how to do that what you're gonna want to focus actually i want you to go ahead and look at this one and then we're gonna go ahead and break it down So right off the bat, you are going to want to let go of the accelerator and launch before it tells you to go, before the timer goes away. And I'm going to go ahead and just pretty much slow that one down by a lot and then just go ahead and show you here with some circles on the screen just how you can go ahead and, up and go about that. Just know for every car is different, so do not try to use this exact same launch on every single car. So here you go. On the needle, you're going to want to keep the needle in between that yellow and green state. Now, before even let's go to the one, just let go of the accelerator and press launch. That way your car will actually start to launch. As you can see, as long as you don't cross those white blocks, you should be good. So I'll go ahead and replay that one more time. That way you guys can get a, a major idea of what you're going to be doing there. So once again, just go ahead and let go of the accelerator and launch before the timer goes away. And it's going to vary for everything. It's going to vary for stuff. In regards to rain and also in regards to snow if you are gonna be doing races in snow which in this game is very random what I would highly suggest is you definitely gonna need some upgrades on your tires because if you don't upgrade your tires you are gonna be running into a lot of issues and let me go ahead and show you what I mean by that here we go so as you can tell there I had a bad launch I just didn't I just didn't know how to do anything on the snow and this is one of my first races as well on the snow point three reaction very slow that's pretty much a guaranteed loss no matter who it is so what I went ahead and did after that is I pretty much went okay I need some upgrades I don't think this car has any upgrades whatsoever so that's something you need to get to and I'm currently showing you here how you can get to the upgrade screen as you can see right there no upgrades on the tires whatsoever and what you can actually do on the first stage usually allows you to get now for free without using any of your diamonds so if you can do that i will definitely recommend it now once i got those tires on the car i went back to racing and let me go ahead and show you what i did here and as you can see there just practice overall and just getting new tires definitely improved my time on the track on snow and on rain as well so if you are having issues with this game just make sure you give yourself some time to practice don't don't get too uh <laughs> don't get too crazy about it because this game is completely different than others so make sure you give yourself some time the launch is completely different and it's one of the cha most challenging things about the game and one of the things that i truly enjoy about the game is that the launch is so challenging so if you want to go back to the section where we slow it down you can definitely go ahead and do that you just you can even slow it down even more on youtube and just keep re-watching that keep re-watching that and see if you can learn anything from that i cannot stress this enough any upgrade you put into the car anything you change to the car will change the launch the weather of the game will change the launch on when you have to release that accelerator so please keep that in mind if it's snowing you're probably gonna have to launch it a little bit earlier if it's raining you're probably gonna have to launch it a little bit earlier if it's sunny then i would say you're probably good you probably don't have any issues in regards to that so there you have it worlds hopefully this video helped you out if it didn't make sure to not leave without leaving a like if you're new to the channel and this is your first time ever seeing my channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button because i will be posting a lot of videos in regards to this game and also i do post in regards to other racing games so if that's what you like, go ahead and subscribe. As always, it has been The Seven Worlds Gaming. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you have a great day. And I will see you in the next one. Take it easy, everybody.